Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Basic Tutorials 20. Today I'm going to show you how to remove the background of an image using the background eraser app. So let's go to the background eraser app. Load a photo from which you want to remove the background. In my case, I'm going to open this image. If you want to crop the image, you can go ahead and crop the image. But in my case, I'm not going to crop it, so I'm just going to hit the done option at the top right corner. Here we go. Now we are in, in the app. So first of all, I'm going to use the auto tool to remove the most of the background of the image. As you can see, I can move the big radar using this small radar at the bottom of the big radar so I'm going to uh, select the part of the image uh, which I do, uh, don't want in the image so the auto tool will automatically remove that parts that parts for me so as you can see it removed the most of the part I don't want in the image but it also removed some of the parts that I do want to keep as you can see uh, our face is removed a little bit our shoulder is not perfect and our hands are not perfect so for this I'm going to use the repair tool so that I can repair the damage that auto selection has done and for some things that auto selection couldn't remove I'm going to use the erase, uh, manual tool here to erase that parts as you can see it's very easy to do for the first time you might find it uh, a little bit difficult but eventually you will find it very easy and one more thing is here the magic tool I forgot to tell you about the magic tool what it does it detects the edges of the image that you want to keep so whenever I put the radar somewhere it detects the edges and doesn't delete the parts that I don't want to be deleted so that's actually magic I can tell you that's really like a magic so I'm just going to now repair the things that auto selection couldn't do perfectly as you can see there is a lot of part that auto selection removed which I need in the image so it's going to take some time so I'm just going to speed up the video and another thing I have another video in this topic in that video I have used the Pixart app that's also a great app for removing the background of an image if this app is not working for you if if you are not comfortable with the background eraser, you can go ahead and check check that video. I will leave the link in the description below. I'm done deleting the background of the image so now what I can do is hit that BG color option at the bottom left corner and see if there is anything left that needs to be erased from the back in the background 
so i don't think i have left anything to, that needs to be erased if there is anything left just use the manual but manual tool to erase it for the first time i use when i use this app i thought i just need to use the auto tool to delete everything i want and i'm done but some correction you still have to do so for the first time you might be bored or bothered about like things to zoom and repair the things like that but when you get your hands on it it will feel a lot easier so i promise just do it once perfectly and you'll enjoy it so that's it from uh, this app for i just removed the background from it now what i'm going to do is hit the done option at the top right corner and i'm going to save it you can increase the smoothness of this image if you want i'm going to leave it at one so um, now i'm going to save the image you can see the option at the top right corner now i'm going to finish uh, i'm going to hit the finish option now we are done now what I'm going to do is open Pixel Lab and open an image that I want as the background of that transparent image. So I'm just going to hit the three dot button option button at the top right corner. I'm going to use an image from the gallery. So I'm just going to gallery and select the image that I want as the background of the image. I want this image as the background. Now I'm going to delete the text here that's already given the text option. Now at the left top corner you can see there is a plus option. I'm going to hit that and we are going to uh tab at form gallery now we are going to select the our transparent image we have selected it now i'm going to hit the send uh, at the bottom center option here you can see the hexagon symbol here now i'm going to hit on relative size and increase the width to 100 percent and height to 100 percent so the image it, it is fit perfectly here i'm going to hit the right option at the bottom i'm going to the magic tool enchantment tool here and I'm going to I'm going to uh, select the who option and increase the who 40 and that's it our image is ready now I'm going to save it you can see the uh, floppy button at uh, at the top right after the plus option hit that and you can see there is a option save as image just hit that and I'm going to save it to gallery and the image is saved so that's it guys that's all for today thank you for watching and please if you have enjoyed the video please do subscribe to my channel and hit the like button and also hit the bell icon to get some more videos like this